The whole idea uh, for this suit came to me when uh, I met some soldiers who had had their legs blown off uh, with uh, with IEDs in Afghanistan and Iraq. Uh, they were they were protected with their torso and their heads because they were wearing good armor. And I asked, why don't they wear armor on their legs? And they said, well, we can't move around in it. And so that hit me. So we've got to be smart enough to know how to invent an armor suit that you can wear from head to toe that would protect you and you'd still be mobile in it. So we took the time in my 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 dad and my my, uh, my friends, we got together and we put this together. My mom helped sew the pieces on it, so it's a family affair. Uh, but we, we tested it, we've shot it, we've blown it up, and now uh, this marathon is a mobility test. If I can do uh, 26.2 miles in this thing, uh, you know, Marines ought to be able to wear the things in combat. And it's designed to do just like what they do. You pop this and you let yourself cool off. You vent right there. And uh, then I also I'm not real concerned about the, uh, the weight because I've been training with a 40 five pound weight vest uh, for about four months and uh, I believe I'm going to be able to get across that bridge before they shut it down. To start with we have the helmet. It's got chin protection. I've actually talked to some folks that there's been a lot of injuries from people getting shot in the face. So we have a bulletproof chin protector and a face shield that deploys that will protect your face as well. It's uh, It will stop bullets and it's sprayed with truck bed liner actually made by Linux. It turns out it makes the armor work better with about 30 percent uh, better and you can hit it multiple times if it's sprayed. Now the suit is multiple layers. The outer layer is just a canvas shell like a tent that's sprayed with waterproofing material. Inside that is uh, plates of ultra high molecular weight polyethylene wrapped in Kevlar and sprayed with the Linex and there are multiple layers of it. And all that we've tested it with IEDs, we've shot it with uh, shotguns, rifles, pistols and it'll stop most things that are not armor piercing rounds. Uh, and you know we really don't have any armor that stops armor piercing rounds right now. That's why they call it armor piercing, right? Uh, the legs are the same, same type of construction. Uh, and, and if you notice it's in segments. And the reason for that is to give you the flexibility you need to do your mission. And uh, then uh, from, from that standpoint, from head to toe, you're covered with uh, an armor system that uh, should at least stop uh, fragments of a low caliber uh, weapons. Fire.